Pacific High School football star joined an elite group today as he was named Gatorade's National Football Player of the Year. Oscar Smith lineman Andrew Brown got the surprise of his <laughs> young life today when NFL great Tiki Barber presented him with his prestigious trophy. And I was lucky enough to be there for the emotional event. It is my distinct pleasure to announce Andrew Brown as the 2013-2014 Gatorade National Football Player of the Year. Linemen don't often stand in the limelight. Words cannot express how thankful I am and how blessed I'm feeling right now. And this truly made my day, my year, my life. You know? <laughs> Andrew Brown radiates his own light. As a defensive tackle, he dominates the line of scrimmage. Often called a man among boys, today he joined a distinguished list. Peyton Manning, wow. Curtis Bray, Emmitt Smith, Jeff George. His size and speed have always given him an advantage. I'll never forget the day he was born and the doctor came in and looked at him and said, he's going to play football. But it hasn't been easy. Brown lost his mother to cancer six years ago this week and was often teased as a middle schooler for being overweight. Big greasy, you know, that's what they used to call me. I sweat bacon grease. <laughs> I heard it all, I heard it all. You know. And hey, now I can say look at me now. A big shot indeed. He's on his way to play for the University of Virginia. Fellow Wahoo and former NFL star Tiki Barber surprised him with the award and is even following him on Twitter. I'm proud that the University of Virginia is going to have his services for the next few years. Brown's future is wide open. Most agree he has the talent and passion to take him to the NFL and the intellect and heart that make him worthy of this honor bestowed only on the best of the best. Andrew Brown is the third player, actually, from Hampton Roads to receive this high honor in football. Hampton's Ronald Curry won in 1998 and Tab's Terry Kirby in 1989. Brown and his Tigers will play for the state championship this weekend in Charlottesville. You'll hear more on that in the Sports Wrap during Wavy News 10 at 6.